cool. Just out here doing a walk around, making sure our fence line is still secure. It's a beautiful, beautiful morning here at Hanson Never Done Farms. Everybody's been fed. And the girls followed us out. To check the fence line. Just something we do once a week. Make sure nothing's trying to dig under. I'm not gonna turn the camera on myself guys cuz it ain't pretty in the morning. <laughs> Bye girls! I think I'm going to feed them again. Oh, Snow. You got it, girl. Oh, there she goes. B. Just a beautiful, calm morning. On this day after Christmas... We hope everybody had a wonderful Christmas. We ended up spending it here by ourselves. I have caught a cold and yeah, so it was fine. We enjoyed the quiet, missed our kids, missed our grandkids. That's uh, never easy. But I want to show you guys what Santa brought for me. Something I have wanted for a long, long time. But we will be prepared for Christmas here at the farm because we now have barn cameras. Yay, there's one there, and there's one there, and they work wonderfully, no problems. These girls are looking really good, good old panda. <laughs> And yes, they love Jeff. Look at that. Yeah, I know, I saw it. Oh, we got a chewer. Anyway. Just a beautiful sunrise on this calm morning. Yeah, no wind. <clears throat> no snow, no ice. Nice, nice. Take you down and show you the chickens. Girls! That's why we don't leave. <laughs> Whenever I put the feed bowls up, you can't leave them where they can put their heads through. Come on, Aspen. Come on, get out of there, you silly girl. We got about five and a half weeks, guys. February 7th. I'm going to get those girls up <clears throat> when I feel a little bit better. Give me a few days. Everybody needs their selenium and hoof trim and I think at this point we can start feeling for babies, especially with her. So we'll get a video to you guys 
hopefully showing that. Today is a barn clean out day. We've had such mild temperatures that uh, we need to scrape this out a little bit and lay down some fresh shavings for them. Hey pretty girls. Hey Zazzy and Polly. Polly, of course, is the pulled and the more friendlier of the two. Zazzy will come eventually. But look at her moon spots. She's got the really pretty chocolate brown ones and then they fade into almost a silver. They're just beautiful. Love, love, love her moon spots. Zazzy, of course, isn't pulled, but uh, she is beautiful, just beautiful. It's like her mama. Bring you guys down and show you the chickens. Of course, we have our four that were the most friendliest. And the nine we got from Twin Bridge Farms, Brian and Teresa, which have really settled down. And then the ten we just picked up. In this group, we have sapphire gems. The rooster is a sapphire gem, and a couple of the hens are sapphire gems. Um, there's Rhode Island Reds. One is definitely in a molt. And the two buff Orpingtons, the Leghorn, and gosh, now I can't, Bard Rock. <clears throat> I think she's a Bard Rock, but I'm super, super excited. Um, I have wanted buff Orpingtons for a long time. So she did say that one is a broody, likes to go broody, and I'm, of course, okay with that. But we have everybody on an all-purpose flock raiser um, pellet. And that's because we have all different ages here. It is a higher protein feed that I tend to feed my flock anyways. And then we just put out oyster shells <clears throat> to help the layers with the calcium and then, of course, the Grub Terra helps with that. Everybody gets scratch grain in the morning. But they've all adjusted real well to living together. They tend to stay in their little groups. Yes, I love to hear a rooster crow. We feel like a farm again, guys. Now if we could just get eggs. <clears throat> Still haven't gotten an egg yet. Hopefully soon. A few of those girls look like they're still in lay. I was told that <clears throat> they were still laying just very, very, you know, sporadic. <clears throat> very sporadically. But as the sunlight increases. We're past the winter solstice and we should start seeing laying increase over the next month. So, but the nesting boxes worked out perfectly. They just haven't visited them yet, but they will. Lots of doings on the farm today. We've got, <clears throat> Jeff's going to take the tractor up and we're going to 
clean up the girls' area and the boys' area. Hi, Cash. Well, hello. He's more interested in what's going on up there with the girls. Case. Anyways, guys, that is our Sunday morning. We hope everyone has a wonderful day. And we will catch you on the next video. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. And we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.